Hey guys, welcome to DVP's Accountability Crib, just two miles from SunTrust Park. It's where the Atlanta Braves play. Less than 20 minutes from Mercedes Stadium, where the Atlanta Falcons play and the Atlanta United soccer team. And less than a mile from the DDP Yoga Performance Center. So you wanna see where the resurrection of Jake the Snake was filmed? Follow me. When you first walk in, the first thing you're gonna see is our dining area. Now this area was, this is where we had all our meetings back when we were actually running our company out of the accountability crib. But, but now it's used for strictly dining. This is more of like a, a celebrity wing where it's got a bunch of different people that I've met over the years from famous athletes to singers to entertainers. As we move down here, well, this is where we really show a lot of the pictures from the accountability crib era where Jake was here and Scott was here. You see the resurrection of Jake the Snake poster here. As you walk in here, we've got an 80 inch television here. Of course, got the fireplace here. And then again, pictures and more pictures. It's kind of like a museum, but not. Uh, and then getting into different guys I worked with and that Jake did and Scott did. If you're a wrestling fan, you're gonna love this place. Before Brenda got here, there was only a couple sticks of furniture in here. And what we used to do was take all the furniture and slide them down the hallways. And this is where we did our live workouts. And this is where we got interviewed by uh, the New York Times Magazine. And we'd get like 16, 18 people crammed into this area. Over here is where we shot our, our cooking shows. And this thing I love a lot because we can you know, we could be from behind and watching TV while we were cooking. Um, this is our coffee area. So if you want to get coffee, we've got the Keurigs right here. Uh, there's, there's so many amazing memories here because when Jake was at Raw and he came out as a surprise when they brought us both to old school Raw that night, nobody knew. They knew I was there, but they didn't know that Jake was there. So when Jake showed up, we got a great reaction from all our people who are watching here. As we head out here, this was actually in the spot where uh, on our porch here, which is beautiful. And this is where Jake, uh, you know, Scott had finally decided he was gonna move on and he was in a better spot. And now Jake was ready. And this is like a spot where it was a, a lot of growth, you know, where he was ready to move on. And I was excited for him. Another uh, table here for eating and of course, you know, if you got your food, we got a plenty big enough refrigerator. Okay, now let's head upstairs. As you head upstairs, this is, I did this for a reason. And this is all of our pictures from when we all got inducted in the Hall of Fame. And just some really awesome pictures there. The first room we're gonna take you in is the Razor Ramon room. And you can see this is a pretty sweet room. And pictures of Scott all around from his different feuds. Of course, you got to have the NWO wall here. And there's a lot of pictures here that people have never seen before, a lot of personal stuff. And now I'll take you into the Jake the Snake Roberts suite. King size bed. Every bed here at the accountability room is a king size bed. And pictures around here of Jake and some of his times on his early days and then some of the resurrection days. One of the cool things about this upstairs area, if there's no one renting the room, we're gonna keep the doors open so people can see all the different rooms. Now, the next room, well, that's my room. That's the DDP Master Suite. And a little bit bigger, a little bit nicer. Uh, again, pictures all around, different pay-per-views that I featured, um, different buddies who have come up here and worked out and. You know, from AJ to Cody to Drew McIntyre, master bathroom and double sinks. One of my favorite things is the electric hot toilet. <laughs> One of your favorite things too. And if I wanted to watch TV and just kick back on every one of these beds, super comfortable, like ridiculously comfortable, and, oh, there's no TV in here. Oh, wait a minute. Yes, there is. And as the lights come down, in the view comes that 160 inch screen. I know, ridiculous, but when I was here at the accountability crib, 
this was my sanctuary. So now you've seen it, the accountability crib. You want a room? Go to Airbnb and lock it down. See you over at the DDP Yoga Performance Center.